Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Simone Speaks. This is gonna be a check in reading for what does the DM feel for the DF right now? I wanted to give you guys an energy update, okay? So if you are wondering how your Divine Masculine feels about you right now, I have pulled some cards to see what messages he has for you. Let's jump right into the energy, shall we? Okay, so I pulled the High Priestess, Ten of Swords, the Emperor. Very interesting how the middle card is the Emperor here. Two of Cups, nice card. Okay, so we got some good cards here that tell us a lot. And Three of Pentacles. So what you need to know right now, DF, is that the Divine Masculine, I feel, is really trying to, like, get himself out of a bad mental space, okay? Or possibly trying to get himself out of a rut. Um, if you guys are not giving each other communication right now, there is an energy of perhaps your Divine Masculine would like to reach out to you, but for some reason... The main energy here is showing that this person right now is trying to recuperate, okay? Trying to um, get his energy, his or hers energy level back up to where it should be. Um, you know, I kind of get the energy here of feeling kind of low, okay? So right now, I feel that they're guardian angels. Um, if your divine masculine was very close to a, a grandparent, that's also coming through here, okay? So perhaps, you know, a grandparent, um, somebody, you know, who passed away could be around them right now trying to give them some reassurance, you know, show them some kind of warmth, some love, some light. So, you know, I feel this energy is also for you as well, okay? So right now, both of you guys are protected. Both of you guys have people who have passed on who are watching over you. I get this feeling very strongly, okay? Um, especially a grandfather or a grandmother, especially grandfather. So if you're divine masculine, he or she divine masculine, um, was close to a grandparent, I feel that they are, you know, right now really, really close to this person in spirit. And this person I feel is, is sending them, you know, little signals and little signs, um, like, like a dove bird or a flower or a poem or something like that I feel is coming through for them. Okay. So while they're trying to heal and, um, Think about think about what the next step is to take because I feel like right now for the divine, for the divine masculine they're trying to figure out what the next step is. It's not so much about um just I feel quickly coming towards you necessarily. It feels more of like you know they're trying to take some time out to clear something away, you know, gain some more perspective. So the energy here is definitely an energy of healing. Okay, them wanting to heal something. Now, I feel for a lot of them, if they're not awake yet, like if you're watching and your Divine Masculine is not awake yet, I feel that they are going to be, um, it's going to be taken up a notch, okay? So they're, they could be getting lots of downloads right now. You know, they could be finally, I feel, realizing that you are their twin flame and they are kind of just like taken aback, okay? This Two of Cups energy is giving me lots of energy here of like, wow, you know, this is somebody who... I had this high priestess, I had this feeling about all this time, and now the Divine Masculine is like, wow, you know, this is really somebody even more special than I already thought, okay? So if your DM I'm also picking up here is with somebody else currently, it feels like they are trying to balance that out. Um, there could be uh, a separation for them with another with somebody else I feel as well like if you're if your DM is married or um unfortunately that hopefully not but if your DM is married or is in a relationship I feel like right now they're really really going through the motions and all they need right now is support from you know spirit and their family and their friends like they just need support right now to get through this so I see lots of sleeping I see lots of hibernation energy I see lots of energy here of them trying to um think about how they can heal themselves as well. Um, I'm hearing holistic. So for somebody watching that's gonna resonate with you, that's your confirmation, but I am hearing the word holistic, okay? So some, something about, you know, um, maybe just a natural way of, of doing something, okay? Could be anything like that. I mean, you know, it could just be really anything, but I'm just picking that up very heavily, okay? So just something to do with, you know, more natural ways of healing the body, healing the mind, um, you know, easing the anxiety, okay? So, there, you know, there could be some kind of um, recreational smoking going on. I, I'm picking that up here, okay, for somebody's DM, okay? There could be some um, 
like herbs, herbal teas, could be could be recreational, uh, you know, stuff. Um, but yeah, something like that. Okay, where they're trying to uh, recuperate. They're trying to recuperate. Let's pull some romance angel here. Let's see the love messages they have to give you today. Let's see what they have to say to you. The love messages. Yeah, the chemistry. So chemistry was showing from the beginning. So we have the chemistry card here, okay? So they are feeling this connection. They, they're they feeling this connection, I almost want to say, stronger than ever. Yeah, because the card says there's a strong magnetic attraction. So they could be fantasizing about you, okay? So if there's lots of sleeping involved, like, you know, uh, meditation or sleeping involved with the Ten of Swords and the Two of Cups. Yeah, if there's an energy here of them wanting to um, rest a lot, you know, maybe go out in nature and just kind of be on a bench or a, a chair or something like that and just kind of sit back and look at the stars or sleep or take a nap. You know, if they go out in nature, I'm picking up. Like if you go out in nature too, like something here about when they're in nature or when they're relaxing, this energy of chemistry comes up, you know, strong, heavy chemistry. So thinking about the good times, thinking about how you guys are so, you know, you guys have so much in common. Wow. Finances and career. So you're on their mind heavily. You know, you are, I, I really feel I can confidently tell you all watching who resonate so far with this message. Yes, your DM is thinking about you while they're healing. Okay. So I don't think for a lot of you and they feel like you're their soulmate. Look at that. Wow. Look at these cards, guys. Beautiful. And reconciliation. Perfect. We got soulmate and reconciliation. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. So, yeah, they think that you're their soulmate. You know, they're really aware. Like, now the DM, I feel, for if not all of you, is totally aware of this connection. And it's not going anywhere. So, right now, they're just needing to really think about how they can get this passion back. I mean, look at the, the picture. I mean, all actually, all three cards, all three cards have the same energy. You know, this guy cooing over this woman and the woman cooing over him and they're just having this this moment alone, you know, like this really, really nice, intimate moment alone. So I feel that they're wanting that. They're wanting to have this 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 moment in time again with you to share it with you and they wanna they wanna reconcile with you, okay? So um the third card I pulled was pay attention to the red flags. So with this card, I feel this card is saying here with their energy. The Divine Masculine's energy. This card for me is showing that they're they're feeling like maybe you are taking a step out of this connection. It's kind of like now that they're awake, now that they're aware, it's kind of like a switcheroo. Okay, like like now that they are aware and they're kind of in this energy, you're not. So you know, the runner chaser. You know, the runner the runner chaser, right? Like. They come in, you come out, you know, somebody steps up, somebody walks out, you know. So this is what their, I feel like this is one of their fears right now. One of their fears is that you are actually going to step out or you, or you already have stepped out. And that's why they're trying to, um, you know, gain back energy, strength, perspective, hope, hope. You know, they're trying to gain back hope in this connection because they want to be this emperor, Okay, they want to be this 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 strong person for you, this leader, right? This leader energy for you. Two of Cups, the Emperor. Yeah, they want to be this for you. Um, but I feel like right now they're in this the planning stages, okay? So I don't see a lot of communication here. I don't see a lot of communicate. These two cards fell out. I'll take it. Look at that. Woo! Look at that. Hierophant. Three of Cups reversed. Four of Wands reversed. So these three cards are just flinged out. <laughs> just, just amazing. Confirm what I just said. Okay. So there could be a fear of a third party. That's what I was picking up and pay attention to the red flag. Okay. So they could be afraid that you are, you found somebody else. You have chemistry with somebody else. But I just feel like in general, they are trying to focus on their money as well. So the vibe I get is like, you know, he, this, the vibe I get is like this, this he or she, you know, to my masculine goes to work, right? The vibe is, I, you know, they go to work, they come home, they sleep. You know, they go to work, they come home, they sleep. So they're trying to replenish something here but trying to gain some perspective okay so right now they're healing and they want you to know that they're trying to heal 
they are aware of this connection they feel the chemistry they feel the love they feel the light um they they they're they're they are fearing a possible soulmate you know like they're they are fearing that there could be a soulmate coming in for you already has come in for you and they kind of feel alone but they know that they have to heal themselves. Like the, the energy here is, 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 is a matter of fact energy. You know, the energy I get here is like they know that in order to have this reconciliation, they need to really fix and heal from a lot of things. And, and I feel for a lot of them, they're juggling with the idea that, you know, you have moved on, you have found somebody else, you know. Um, for a couple of you, there's an energy here of them juggling with the idea that you... Um, you know, already found a soulmate, another soulmate, okay? Um, that's not them, you know? And so they're trying to balance this, you know, three of pentacles, two of cups. You know, they are trying to balance this connection, you know, to, to be able to reconcile with you. But I think it's just all behind the scenes, you know? For those of this resonates with, you're going to get what I'm saying. It's all behind the scenes, you know? And I kind of want to say on the 5D, okay? On the 5D is where I feel like they're they're going to meet you. They're meeting you. It's not 3D right now, okay? This is your DM to DF update, guys. Love you all. Take care. Bye.